These are the steps of the Nico Train Cymex Sharpener uses to sharpen shears. Step 1. The sharpener will analyze the shear. Analyzing the shear allows the sharpener to know what angle to use based on the quality, the health of the shear, also the type of cutting the stylus is doing, what grit to use, and what repairs might need to be done. Step 2 is to do the actual repairs to what we call the hardware which is like the screw, the bumper washers, the finger rest. Those are done first and preliminary. Once that is done, the shears are disassembled, if it's a convex edge shear, and then they're cleaned with rubbing alcohol and a soft microfiber cloth. Once they're cleaned, we mark it with a red Sharpie. This allows us to see if we've reached the correct angle and whether the metal is removed. The Sharpie will be wiped off at the end of the process. The next step in sharpening is to create a ride line. Ride lines are created with a Japanese style water stone and that gives a very flat, very smooth inside surface for the cutting. Step eight is to set the shear precisely in the clamp at the right angle and the right degrees for the type of shear and the type of cutting that's needed. The clamping system allows precision that handheld free hand sharpening would never allow. Step nine is to begin sharpening using an airplane landing. This means that you're gingerly and gently reaching the angle of the shears so as not to reshape and change the shear edges from what it was originally intended to have. Step 10 is to create the burr. The burr should be as small as possible to remove whatever blemishes and nicks are along the edge. Step 11 is to reshape and remove grind marks. This allows the sharpener to recreate the true convex shape that was intended in the factory so that the shears will slide gracefully and smoothly through the hair. Step 12 is to now remove the burr. The burr must be created and removed in order to get a true sharp edge. Step 13 is polishing. The polishing is done with a spacer so as not to round over the now sharp edge but to remove any outside burrs. Step 14 is to check and double check for any residual burr that might snag the hair and create a pull in the hair. And the last step is to check the shears. We do a cut test. Cut test may be done on specially prepared testing material or it could be done on actual hair. This is the 15-step process for sharpening your high-quality convex-edge Japanese-type shears by Benica Trang Cymex Sharpeners.